Automotive simulations enable engineers to quickly, safely and economically challenge and validate their ideas within synthetically created worlds. There are many types of automotive simulations. For example, software in the loop or seal simulations connect soft ECU models to check hard-to-test corner case traffic scenarios. Xylon teamed up with the company RF Pro, an expert in driving simulation software, with the goal of exchanging the soft ECU model with its physical counterpart, the real hardware ECU. Transition from seal to hardware in the loop or hill simulations brings a higher dimension of realism and confidence to simulation results. Real ECUs read physical stimuli data and simultaneously generate responses that electrically and logically correspond with internal buses of an operational vehicle driving along the road. Consequently, the seal to heel transition requires conversion of synthetic simulation data into real automotive interfaces. Instead of using many different conversion boxes, we at Xylon use our own logic recorder automotive heel video logger to convert all simulation data into automotive data and vice versa, automotive data into simulation inputs. With more than 20 integrated automotive interfaces, this single box solution for data logging and heel playback breaks boundaries between the simulated and real world. Let's do a quick overview of the demo system built by Xylon and RF Pro. The demo setup includes three main parts with attached monitors. The PC that runs the RF Pro simulator, the logic recorder working as a smart I.O. conversion box, and Xylon's Surround View Parking Assistance ECU. The Surround View Parking System enables the driver to see the complete surroundings by adjusting the position of the virtual flying camera in 3D space. This ECU is selected because of its highly visual nature. It uses four high-resolution video cameras and requires a continuous input data throughput of 240 megabytes per second. Of course, the presented system can be adapted for other ECUs. The first monitor displays the streets of RF Pro's Paris City Digital Twin and the traffic captured by the simulated front vehicle's camera. Alongside with environment, traffic and vehicle simulation, RF Pro enables independent sensor models to run in parallel. The demo uses four video camera models. Simulation data are shared through RF Pro's inter interface for externals. Xylon team made the data transfer software plugin. In order to align the simulated video with the expected real camera formats, we need to switch the pixel format from RGB to YUV, add fisheye lens distortions, timestamps and video synchronization signals. Prepared data are packaged into MIPI packets, which are standard for modern CMOS camera sensors, and then they are streamed down to the logic recorder via 10 gigabit Ethernet over fiber optics. The logic recorder converts Ethernet data into video frames uh, compliant with outputs of ECU-supported video cameras. The middle monitor shows video streams from four model cameras. Synthetic camera videos are streamed to the ECU via the GMSL2 high-speed serial interface. The ECU runs standard production firmware. It takes GMSL2 video inputs and generates a 3D surround view output displays on this monitor. Data latency from the PC to ECU is very short and in milliseconds range. In open-loop simulations, the latency can be fully ignored. The demo also works in the closed loop. Here, my colleague drives the simulated vehicle with a gamepad connected to the ECU. User controls are converted into CAN messages and sent back to the PC via the logic recorder and Ethernet link. This efficient and very economical hill system enables full software controls of hardware ECU running at full operation speed. Presented products can be easily switched and adjusted to support other more specific simulation needs. Thank you for watching.